morning guys and welcome back to our final full day here in New York. Sadly, we do have. I know it's a bit sad. We do have tomorrow uh, morning, early afternoon as well, so it's not too bad. We've just this is just our final full day. Uh, we've just had breakfast at Essa Bagel. Essa Bagel again. I filmed what we had. It was very difficult to film there because it was super, super busy. Um, so I filmed obviously what we had, and mine was so much better than the last time we had. I had a uh, chicken parmo, I think it was. This time I had a pastrami and cheese. Oh my god. Yeah. So much better. Yeah, I just had cream cheese bagel, standard. Mine was $16 as well, do you know what I mean? Oh, I also got a Gatorade as well. Uh, $16 mine was. I don't remember how much mine was, but it was just a cream cheese bagel, so it wouldn't have been too much. Oh, just I a plain one. But how good it is it all? Yeah, well, I love bagels anyway. Put it on I your list. I know you can have that at home, but it's one of my favourite like combos. Yeah, put it on your list. On a bagel, it's so good. Yeah, there is other bagel places around, which I presume are just going to be similar as well, so... If you can't find an Essa bagel, obviously try the others, they're probably all the same. You can't go wrong with a bagel. No. Um, we're just but waiting on Perry and Soft to finish up now, then we're going to go to 34 Harold Street Station, or Harold Street, I think it might be, and we're going to get the subway to Coney Island. I Coney think Island, it's, I think it's actually not, that's, that's incorrect. It's 14 stops, I think it is, to Brighton Beach, and a 12 minute walk up the beachfront to Coney Island. And okay. then maybe chill out on the beach, go in a few shops, and then hit the fairground if it's open. I've got the drone. GoPro. Oh, yeah, we've got quite a lot of cameras with us so today. So I am Try ready. Trying to get some good different footages yeah. and stuff. So yeah, we'll show you when we get there. I am prepared. So let's go. When you're down and you stare at your window, hoping that you'll come up with some words to say. That's not okay. When you feel like you're fed up with heartbreak. We've just got to Coney Island Beach. I think I think I did say it was 14 stops. I think it was 20. I'm pretty sure it was 20 stops. It was a 49 minute train journey and a four minute walk. Um, we got off the stop after Brighton Beach and then it's literally just a four minute walk up the front of Coney Island. You, you, knew you could go come to New York and see a beach. Look at it. I didn't. So like <laughs> I said, me and Perry have been before. Um, the weather today, like, it definitely trumps the last time we came because it was about minus six, so. Oh, yeah to actually come to the beach we've seen that they've actually got showers so we're thinking we might go into the uh, into the ocean we'll see how we feel uh, but we have seen the fairground is on so we're definitely going to head over there see how much it costs to go on the fairground and i might get the drone up because i think i think i'll be able to who knows be sneaky fingers crossed <laughs> 
sections of the fun fair. Two. It's two sections. This is Luna Park one anyway. So I think the first one is you can go on any ride unlimited for $69. We'll ask anyway. And then obviously single rides are I don't know what the cards for. I think they could be for the games that you play or you like the stalls. What is it? Four hours unlimited rides for the first one? Okay. Got me banned, didn't I? He's got his wristband. I'm thinking I might go on to Cyclone, the big coaster. It's a big roller coaster. Yeah. It's in this park, though. I think there's. Do you remember watching Crystal Palace's video? She said there's two like bits to it. Sorry. There's one which is Luna Park, which I think we're in, which is like more smaller rides, but some of these I'm not. I wouldn't even go on. So it's a smaller ride. So can I go over there? Yeah, but not yet. I, yeah, I don't think. All right. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. Um, well, that's coming. Let's cover these. Oh, these different ones. Obviously, the Ferris wheels there. Circus posters. A bit like um, the Alice Storm and that. Yeah. Oh, There's something that looks like Primeval World as well. Over there. Which looks good.
She said that uh, you can't buy singular ride tickets, but you actually I'm a liar, can. Guys. I'm a liar. She lied. She just we went on the uh, tickler and she paid eight dollars for it. It was eight dollars. I was gonna film it on the GoPro, but you weren't allowed to take it on. So Sophie did the honors and tried to get the best footage she possibly could of us. Um, which it is what it is. Sometimes you can get on, sometimes you can't. Yeah, so um, you can, um you get like there's like a card that they sell and then um, one credit is one dollar yeah. and that ride was eight credits so i paid eight dollars and i got on it so I you're done it. for rides now aren't you that's it now for yeah. me yeah i yeah. don't think there's anything else i'm not bothered about i'm going to keep checking around and see what else i can go but first things first we need a drink got some lemonade from old daughter three dollars yeah they were three dollars each they're quite nice aren't they you need it on a, on, on a hot day like this. Yeah, we have got a lot of these um, free water stations in the bathroom, but I just wanted some like, a bit with, more. With flavour. Mm. And we love the lemonade at the Yeah, so. lovely. Harry's Ooh. getting one. Ooh. So this is where we ate in um, MCR. I thought, wasn't it? We had Nathan's. Nathan's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we had no clue what it was. And apparently it's famous from here. Is this like the original place? You know what, I don't want to say. But when I read online, I'm pretty sure it was. Look how old school this is. Like, it's so old school. It's proper old school American. American. Just what you think a fun pair would be. And like the pier, the boardwalk. I also need to find a cap for, for a friend of mine. Oh, um, right, yeah. He, he lost it at a go-karting rink, so he needs another one. Because I've, let's, let's be honest, you don't come here very often. So if I see one, I'm going to get him it. He was in, I saw a gift shop in that other room, that was in that room park. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I actually think it's on one of the side stores like this, if there's a little oh, gift we shop. Can have a little look in, yeah? mm -hmm. This is the store! Oh. This is where he got his cap from! Right, let's, let's, have going, let's go in and have a look. These are $39, I think. Wow. Oh, look at these are. We've got a Brooklyn one as well. Um, so cool. So, so cool. So cool. Oh, tea towels. Oh, yes. I love stuff like this. Glasses as well. Oh, I actually have a matching jacket for this, actually, in like a, a creamy, creamy colour. I'll get to Fox and see it. In like a cream colour. $58 this is. But I tell you what, all the clothes feel so so good, like really good quality. Such good quality. These are lovely as well. Again, $58. I think this is part of Luna because the tickets. Yes, so there's more rides for me to go on. This is what we're going on next. Soaring Eagle. <laughs> Push over the limits with you right now. Gotta get it right now. Yeah, push over the limits with you right now. Gotta get it right now. Yeah, push over the limits with you right now.
until I got to the top. But then when you get to the top, you just see the city and everything like, wow. So as I was saying before, we went to that shop. Come to the Wonder Wheel, we're in the, in the queue for swinging. Lucy is not a fan, so she won't be making this ride. Uh, it wasn't included on my band, it was $10 each. So, I mean, we have to do it, right? It's, it's 100 and what? 100, 100 years old. 100 years well, old. 102 now. Yeah, yeah. construction began in 1918. Yeah, and it's officially an American landmark, so obviously we have to do it. I think as is here. Oh. Are you guys good behind, yeah? Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> a swinging one. I've no idea how long this is. Oh, it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be sick. It's gonna be so good. I tell you what, I was very surprised at how many rides are here. Yeah. Like in it, like, like I don't. We definitely don't have time for me to hit all of them, which is sad, really. But there's you, get, all... you get four hours on it, planned. Yeah. What time did we get here? I don't even know anymore. Yeah. I don't know, but it's it's well worth the money. Like I said, if you want to smash out the rides like I've been doing, yeah. well worth the money. Hey! hey, hey. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh my goodness! Oh, wow! I Whoa! Didn't expect that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> yeah, that's it. So now we're going to swing and swing. Woohoo! Woohoo! Oh my god! <laughs> This is intense! Yeah. Oh, that's why they say don't put your hands outside the car. Oh, you get caught. Oh my god. Yeah, don't put your hands outside because of them there. You lose your fingers. Look at you! Oh my goodness, it's a big spectacle! That was hilarious! Oh my god. He's going to do that for every single one. Literally. Oh, I can't wait for a while. And there's a city, they can just make it out. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh. I've never been on one of these. They do one in LA. I'm pretty sure Lucy mentioned it in Disneyland. Obviously, I've never been there, so this is the first one I've ever been on. What a place, though. So, where's Mark the Wahlburgers supposed to be? Where that little I think it's down there. I think it's down there. So, originally, we planned to go to Wahlburgers for tea. Yeah. Apparently, it's shut in 2017. So, yeah, so. Obviously we're not going there. <laughs> oh, we're going again. See it, see it.
search getting on. Yeah, I'm getting there. Mm -hmm. Like I've, I've only found this one. I was just looking at pictures to see what his hat used to look like. Oh, right, yeah, let's have a see that. Do you know, but it's not as good as the one he had before. Mm. Do you know what I mean? This is just weird. <laughs> it's quite scary. It was kind of like. Um, it reminds me of like that person of Jaws. Not Jaws, sorry. Uh, saw that thing off Saw. Jigsaw. Jigsaw. Like it was very, very similar to that. <laughs> that kind of torn, yeah. Oh, that's cool. But it like was like a, um, like a like a like a khaki green. Right. That's that's what the hat was. We've got a red one. We've got this one with like the beach. Even if it wasn't. Should we just get him like a similar one? Oh, that's the, um, the fun wheel thing, fun wheel. the wonder wheel, oh, sorry. That well. That'll be cool. And there's obviously Nathan's ones as well, which I think we're actually going to eat at, actually. The famous Nathan's. Mm. So many clothes, so many t-shirts. You've got like joggers, vests, swim shorts. Like all kids stuff, you've got like swimsuits, bikinis, even flip flops, beach bags, you've got like blankets and towels, so much merch for Coney Island, if you guys are wanting anything with Coney Island on Brooklyn, there's even just New York merch as well. Yeah. Oh, which one of you got? I really like oh, yeah, it is. that one. Oh yeah. my god, it comes in green. Or this one. What's that one? I like that. That one. Or oh, that. But I think I prefer that one because the colours. I colors. think I prefer the grey. It's so retro. I think I prefer the colour. It looks more retro and that's a bit amazing. And it's, yeah, I think I'm going to get it. $20. Yeah, $20. That's insane. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I think all the t-shirts are $20. Yeah, they're much, much better. Yeah. Large, this one. Yeah, you won't be any bigger than that, would you? But that's a large for context. I like how retro it is, you know what I mean? Yeah, I love the, pa the pattern. Would you call it a pattern? Uh, yeah, I'd call it a pattern. The graphic. And that on the back. Yeah. Yeah, Funny Island Beach shop. Yeah, it's really cool, isn't it? Look at the bottom. How's it fit? Does it fit all right? Yeah, I think that's I think that's a good size. Oh, we're gonna match. Match, match. Match me. Twenty dollars. So yeah, we're gonna eat at Nathan's, and this is the original one. Since 1916, it's been around. Over a hundred years. I think it's just down there. So I'll show you what we get. Okay, so I got a large cheese oh. fries. Look at that. That cheese looks sick. And that cheese is going to be Done incredible. It. And then, so you obviously got the same. The same, but you got a smaller one, oh. didn't you? Oh. And then I pretty much got the exact same as what I did in Orlando Airport yeah. in the last vlog series. But I got a chili cheese dog, which is this one, and then you got the bacon cheese dog, bacon right? Cheese dog. I am so excited for this. That cheese looks incredible. It is so good. And yes. How sir. much did it come to? Twenty five dollars. Twenty five dollars. We didn't get any beverages. We've already got Auntie Anne's. Yeah, so. we, you've seen us get the Auntie Anne's, which are just there. So we just got the food this time. But would you believe very this place is like one hundred and six years old? Yeah, Nathan's. That's mental. And when we went to the one in Orlando Airport, we were like, what's this? Like, we never even uh, had a clue. What's Nathan's? <laughs> yeah, and then... It's this. Th and this. Like, we're at, literally at the original now. Oh, my God. Insane. Wow. Also, it's home of the International Hot Dog Eating Contest. Dun, dun, dun. I reckon you would probably, you'd probably give it a go, wouldn't you? If we were I'd, here and it was on. I'd do terrible, but I'd give it a go. We are, we are, even the viewers at home, we all know what you can put down, yeah? So, you could give, I reckon you could give them a good go. I do, 
I give my best shot. I reckon you, yeah, you, I reckon you do well. I'm an, but honestly, I'm an absolute legend. You're a machine, that is what you are. <laughs> I can't even open this. So we just sat in this like seating area as well outside in the shade, but it's lovely, isn't it? It's beautiful. So nice. So, yeah. Nathan's, the original Nathan's. I love it. Open all year. We are done here at Coney Island. It's currently I'm quite sad um, though, actually, to leave. twenty past five. Yeah, I'm, I'm sad to leave because I really want to see it at night. It's, it's stunning. It would be sick at like if you stay for sunset with the beach and yeah. stuff. If it's nice weather, because there is a few clouds now coming, but yeah. I reckon it'd still be nice. But and seeing, then obviously seeing it at night, lit seeing up. the fun fair lit up. Wow. Well, I bet it's booming. But I can definitely recommend it. It is so so cool here. So the plan right now is we're going to head back into New York City, uh, get quickly changed because we've got a comedy show. So first yeah. things first, we need to catch the train in three minutes. So we gotta go. Two hours later. Okay, don't forget to drink them. So, yeah. Yeah. yeah, have I already checked you in for the show? Oh, yeah, I have to. Okay, let um, just check me in there. Okay, we, as you can tell, we've arrived. It's very roadie in here. But it costs us five dollars to be here, so absolute steal. And the drinks, I will show the drinks menu in a second. Um, it's fairly cheap, like around nine dollars a cocktail. When you compare that to like the theatre last night, super super cheap. Rub it in, All right? I enjoy myself. But I mean, surprisingly cheap, isn't it? Yeah. It's basically two drink minimum. They say. Um, so you basically could get two soft drinks or two alcoholic drinks, whatever you want. But, no, no, they're not, <laughs> ran, they're not random people. They are just uh, reps, the street reps. And you, normally you're time to go away, but this time we decided to listen to it because me and Parry have actually done this before. Um, and he sold them to us for $5 each, so normally the 30, we got them for five. So, steal. Obviously we didn't get changed, can you tell? We, we had... Sweaty people. We had no time. So, we're gonna order a couple of drinks. I'm gonna have a cocktail. I'm gonna try a screw, screwdriver. I'm going to try a screwdriver, no idea what that is. At this time, it's 
pleasure to introduce your host this evening. He's a regular at clubs and colleges all over the country. Please give a warm New York City welcome for Mr. Spencer Silio. What is up? Broadway Comedy Club, make some noise for coming out tonight, guys. Make some noise. I went skydiving a couple of years ago, right? There's two options. If you ever want to go skydiving, right? You can go attached to a dude with a ponytail. <laughs> and look at the time, I had one, he had one. I'm like, they're gonna touch, that's gonna be weird. <laughs> I mean, our ponytails get all wrapped up into each other. I mean, we're connected spiritually at that point. You know, I saw Avatar, you know what I mean? <laughs> but they had another option. You can learn how to skydive first time, no questions asked. Go skydiving by yourself first time, you gotta lean out of the plane and you gotta turn back and give a little hand signal to your trainers to let them know that you're about to skydive. I don't know if you can tell by looking at me, I don't have a real solid center of gravity. As soon as I leaned out of the plane, I just left the plane. <laughs> I started doing flips over and over when I got into the sky. You know, they could have been cool, right? If they were planned, you know? But I eventually Mary Poppins my way back down to the ground. And my girlfriend came running up. She was so excited. She could not wait to skydive again. She was really into it, you know? So we broke up. <laughs> What's your name, bro? Matthew. Matthew, right. Pleasure to meet you, bro. They fuck with you. They, they like you. They like you. They don't like Matthew. <laughs> Matthew, you smoke weed? Oh, yeah! yeah. What's up? Huh? No! Matthew. Y'all look like the police or something? I don't give a fuck. Yeah, you're a merchant marine, right? You should be transporting it. I'll be waiting right at the dock, though. Here they come. Here they come, right now. Let me get my money ready. Get my shit fresh off the ship. Weed is legal now in New York City. Whoever thought it would be? Yeah, now when people visit here, we gotta change the song though. Now the song is like, Welcome to New York. Concrete jungle, legal weed's brand new. It's something you can do. Light up in New York, New York, New York. Then you see a picture of the Statue of Liberty with the torch lit and me next to it, like, ah! It's lit! So we've just come out of the uh, comedy show. What do we all think? Yeah, like, well, well, for five dollars, what we paid. Was, I thought it was sick. Yeah, really? For five dollars each, that was really, class. Really good. The only thing we had, we had, it was very roady in there, wasn't it? Yeah, Super but I, roady. Seeing the Sepoy outside, like, it made the atmosphere, though, I think. Oh my god, yeah. So imagine just everyone being dead like, quiet when there were jokes on everyone. It would just be dead awkward. Yeah. Wouldn't it? So we like, had. It, was, like, it actually made it better, I think. Yeah, it was, no, it was great, like, yeah. fantastic. We had uh, some frozen cocktails. Lucy, didn't you, didn't did you? Uh, no, it was basically. I tried yours. It was nice. We basically paid five dollars a minute to get two drinks, so we got some frozen cocktails. It was definitely well worth it. Uh, but it's now <laughs> currently half nine, um, and we just sat outside the plaza. Just. Really loudly. <laughs> right, what did you do? No, the lady behind us Oh, the lady near us, forehead. She let out some wind. Um, yes, yeah, so we're just going to sit right. It is our last night, so we're going to hang around here for a little bit and then maybe go to Mackey's. I think, so, yeah. I think we're going to go to a Mackey's. Get a bite to eat. They've gone. Yeah. They've lost I'm it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't. We're in the plaza and people are farting. <laughs> How dare they? Do they know where they are? Stinky! Uh, yeah, we're gonna hang around here uh, and just have a wander around really. Grab some, um, grab a Mackey's and then at yeah. some point head back because we have got an early morning and we literally need to go to Bloomingdale Outlets, uh, Bath and Body Works and Target just to get loads of random snacks and crap to take on. snacks. Yeah. Well, oh, we won't eat them on the plane, we'll eat them when we get out. But that's yeah. the plan, so I'll, if we go anywhere or eat, which we will be doing, yeah. I will show you. We have made it! Oh, it's so quiet. Give me some nuggets. <laughs> Large fries and chocolate pretzel McFlurry. Which we don't get in the UK. No, and look at that. Oh my god. Wow. I think the pretzels are like chocolate pretzels and we've got chocolate sauce. Beautiful. Amazing. Beautiful. I've just gone for some nugs and a uh, chicken. So, yeah. Oh, interesting. Here she is, Gwen Stefani. 
I've had it twice today, guys. Twice in one day. Apparently, I look like Gwen. Gwen's the I actually got this free food for free. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen better days. Would you like my autograph? Yes. Gwen Stefani. Gwen, please. <laughs> I need it. <laughs> right, seriously, guys. Honey. They do honey sauce. Now, Nat and Ben, I know, adding honey to chicken sounds disgusting, but it's a game changer. It's the elite. Like, it's super sweet. Super thick. Me selling these chicken nugs, aren't I? <laughs> Come to Mackey's, get some chicken nugs. Get some honey. Absolute game changer. Would you ever thought you'd be Mackey's with Wednesday Sarni? Tonight. Two people, I've never heard that before. Two people. Who do I look like? I'm Johnny Depp. I'm charging for pictures for people. Get your pictures of Gwen Stefani and Yeah. Stefani. So good. That is it. We are done. Sorry, Fred. I cut you out. Get out. We are <laughs> done for our final <laughs> evening here in New York. This time tomorrow, we're going to be on a plane. Can we not talk about that? <laughs> But the vlogs are coming to an end. The vlogs are coming to an end. But we have one more day. We still have the morning and the afternoon. We're gonna need, well we need to go to Bloomingdale out there because we need to get some shopping in. Um, and some snacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna go fairly early. Uh, it's currently what half ten, so we're gonna get the tube back. The tube? It's like I'm in London. Oh, yeah. We're gonna get the subway back to the hotel. Um, saves us a 45 minute walk. And then we're gonna obviously hit the hay because we are done. But today has been absolutely fantastic. Uh, I rode some rides. We've had ice cream. Uh, cream, we've actually. been to the beach. <laughs> Coney Island, go to Coney Island if you come to New York. You have to go. It's yeah. insane. It's so so good. But until then, we are done. So thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful evening. Please do like and subscribe if you have enjoyed this video. And I forgot what I was saying. Was staring at us. I was getting stared at by a woman. <laughs> she was enjoying the vlog ending. She was. She was. <laughs> like you and subscribe. subscribe. Yes, have a wonderful evening. And we'll see you next time. Bye.